There's got to be some skills. There's got to be touches. You can get as many, you go 20 minutes in our game today, the way we have our schedule set out, we might only be on the ice 20 minutes. We might only be on the ice 15, maybe 30 minutes. So how many touches do they actually get? How many reps do they actually get? So by doing this, and this is for all skill drills. So when you're looking at this for the power play, think about it as different things. Think about your offensive zone forecheck. Think about your offensive zone play. Think about your D zone coverage. How can you break this down to make it a one-on-one, -on -one, a one-on-two, a two-on-two, a two-on-three, a three-on-two? How can you break it down to the simplest form so that they have success? They get touches, they have success. Or maybe it's a two-on-oh, maybe it's a one-on-oh. Whatever it is, how, do they, how can you break it down? And we're all smart here. Just a matter of taking the time to try and develop.